orders are as follows. Good morning, guys. Welcome back to our Baldur's Gate 3 playthrough where... Uh, yes, we are in the Dan Crypt because I remembered that we still have a sarcophagus that uh, we can disarm the chaps off it. And I think I might have mentioned it in a previous episode that we're gonna come back here, but then I got distracted with uh, something else. And I decided to start it here because nothing else happened. Except that uh, I did improve Lazelle's equipment a bit. Apparently she can wear heavy armor. Not sure why I couldn't see it. I, I think it's because the game sometimes shows, he, shows me that uh, it's not proficient. But sometimes you hover, this shows it's proficient. It's uh, the... I would consider it's a glitch from the game. And that's a bit confusing. I'm gonna have to all the time check to remember who can wear what and wield. Because I do remember I had the heavy armor and I said, oh, I'm gonna just gonna sell it because nobody can wear it. I was thinking about Kylak, but apparently Lazel could have wore it. So, yeah, I have a heavy armor for Lazel. And then I got a two-handed mole hammer for her as well. But she's still in, back in the camp. Now we have a stallion selected. So let's hopefully... Uh, actually, before... Before, before I do that, everybody just stick around here. Let's uh, untoggle group mode. Because if uh, shit hits the, ha the fan, well, at least uh, it's just a stallion taking damage. Okay, a stallion, don't fail me now. Oh, it's a difficulty of 10. Basically, I need to roll a 1 for this. If I roll 2, we got it. If I roll one, then it's gonna automatically fail anyway. Okay. So that's the traps. Is that blood? No. Okay, Asterian. No Tread carefully. And these things have stayed interesting. Good. I think I'm safe to group them back up. Moving in. Yeah, let's see. Oh, the Watcher's Guide. This is a spear. Can be thrown. That's promise. When the spear misses its target, the wielder's next attack roll against that target gains true strike. And then an engraved key. Okay. Let's see. Not that. And also, wasn't it another? So that's uh, outside. Okay, the chest is empty. I thought for a second. Uh, that's resurrection. Torch. Yeah, get it. Apparently, I'm kind of low on torches for other characters. Can I open this one now? Yeah. The engraved key, but unfortunately, I've already been here through another way. Didn't I already check this one? Yes, I did. Heavy chest. As it says, explore the ruins. We found a locked door, but it doesn't have a keyhole. Am I missing something here? No traps, please. <laughs> okay, that uh, chest is actually empty. Cool. Tom scribe. Yeah, I think I got most of it out of here so where was that door it says it had no keyhole is yes, i believe it was here right that's from no Let's 
scribe of the dead. Must be one ancient chapel. Oh, did I press this button? Oh, hi, hello. This is oh wonderful. Okay. We're gonna have a fight. Oh hell. Something just woke up. Literally a dawn of sarcophagus. Heavy chest. Uh warrior. Scribe. Scribe. Who is first Asterian? The path is interrupted. Not exactly see him, right? Uh, okay. Fire resistance, all good. Yes. I, I would say actually, I mean, no. Uh, Good position here. I won't give in. In my opinion. Um I think I do have something. Maybe holy water could be of use. Antidote. No, there was wrath of water. Okay, scroll of grease. I'm gonna let me throw that one there. Just Another gonna let them forward. come to us. This is my time. Let's see if I can hit with the Eldritch Blast. Eight, ten, not bad. Now this is my happy place. <laughs> yes, it is, Kalak. Okay. Oh, that's. Like I, I thought you're not gonna hit. Okay, let's see. Ah, I have one guy over here as well. So they're gonna dash. Hopefully that grease that I throw. Yeah, I think it's a relatively good position. They need to either pass through it or they might just skim close hmm. by. What's that? Okay, ooh, ninety percent. Arm string, yes. And then I yeah, wonder if it's worth the cost. And then myself. Mm, not sure if I need if poison is helpful against these guys though. Fiends are undead. These guys should be undead, right? Yeah. So the holy water can be of help. I'm just gonna. Path is interrupted. Really? Can't you just move? Oh, I. Uh, whoops! I think I got myself stuck. Hmm. Need Tasha's hideous laughter. Great, I just got myself stuck. Didn't I had just gonna shoot like that? Nice. Yeah, some objects have toughness, whatnot. Battle favors the fearless. Okay, so I need uh, not to get myself stuck. Gotcha. It's high ground. Watch and learn. It's level five. Nice. Let's stay here then. All right, Karlak. It's go time. The bonus action. Here's protection. 
course he missed. God damn it. Mm. Should I? No, I'm gonna react. I'm gonna keep it. Ah, okay. He is okay uh, because uh, that's extra health that he lost over there. But react, I'm fine as well. There's not a lot of damage. This will do nicely. Fire resistance, grease bottle. Is that a bonus? No, that's an action. I need to get rid of somebody. Nice. Okay, no back but here. Keep going. Now I can move. Six. No holding back. Watch him get, get rid of that guy. Nice. And you got extra health. You can Fuck yes. partially tank then. Down the hatch. Ooh, that's a nice damage, Kalek. He's not moving. <laughs> Interesting. And I think because of the grease. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. That was not bad. Starion. Blood comes easy these days. So that means I can just safely Here we go again. just don't pile on him. No holding back. Not the Reddish Blast, it should be over. Nice. Even after death. The unthinking cadavers. I may as well feel sorry for a bread basket. Uh, now unfortunately, the grease is here. I might fall. <laughs> Just like that. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I wonder if the gods are watching me. I mean, they're watching you fall down, yes. They're like... I mean, technically, that guy couldn't come close, you know? So you could say, that's not bad. And looks like also, I've not Something looted all of these guys, or... Ah, okay, I can take this path, so I don't need to go all over the grease. Which... Eh. I think the grease is gone anyway. So yeah, looks like some scribes I missed. A lot of effort to hide one sarcophagus. And ooh, oh, speak with the dead. Amulet of lost voices. Jergals. Then we have. Alchemical ingredients. So those ones. Ah, already went into the pouch. Perfect. Sharp as ever. Come on, let's go. Uh, maybe I'll keep this for Gale. Speak with the dead. It's like a spell. We'll see. It's not a bad one, though. Moving ahead. Right. Who? Here lies the guardian of tombs. Through knowledge comes atonement. All right. Let's. Oh, hello. So we're not exactly looting. Okay, somebody's in there. Friend or foe? I'm just curious if I'm gonna have a boss battle, a big one right now. So he has spoken, and so thou standest before me, right as always. 
What a curious way to awaken. Now, I have a question for thee. What is the worth of a single mortal's life? Oh. Oh. Okay. Okay, quite the questions. I mean, yeah, that is quite the question. What's the reason for it? So he has spoken. What are you talking about? But yeah, okay, a peaceful and dead. Interesting. Why aren't you attacking me? Because that would be senseless. Wilt thou answer my question? Okay. We're gonna engage in philosophical <laughs> talks with uh, Withers? Apparently the name is is Yeah, ask away. So I ask again. What is the worth of a single mortal life? Ha! Okay. We do have two other options. Bard, a life is worth as only as much as the legends remember it. Or Tiefling, in my experience, that depends on what the mortal looks like. Uh, the other uh, answers will be the only life that matters is mine. Uh, so I don't think these, the last three, I'm gonna take into consideration. So let's see the other ones. Each life is of an infinite value and merits sacrificing everything for. That's an interesting answer. Life's only value is as currency. Doesn't matter to me otherwise. Yeah, we're not gonna answer that one. That depends on a person's deeds. Uh, I mean the second one, yes, but I kind of don't see this answer seeing like the bigger picture, you know, on the long run. So, so far, number four. Or number one. I mean, no one life is worth more than any other. We are all equal. In death, that is so. Very well. I am satisfied. We have met, and I know thy face. We will see each other again at the proper time and place. Farewell. Uh, okay, bye. Can, wait, can we talk more? Or, let's see, come on, come on, come on, come on. He's walking. We have nothing more to discuss. Continue on thy way. As if I were not here. I must attend this place after so many years away. We will see each other again. Soon. Oh, Bard, seems you'd read ahead in our little story. The mechanics of fate would be difficult to explain to one such as thyself. Regardless, it will occur. Can we check We have more? nothing more. I must attend this place after so many years away. We will see each other again. Soon is rather vague. When, when exactly? When the time is proper. I do not know that hour any more than dost thou. But I do know that the longer thou standest here, the farther away our <laughs> second meeting becomes. <laughs> okay. Hey, he said it well. It looks like uh, there aren't any options to have a bit more in-depth conversation with him. Hey, that was not a bad fight. And uh, it took a bit of damage, but not much. 
Uh, okay. So that completes. Explore the ruins. We found a large sarcophagus hidden in the ruins. Who lies within? So we're done here. Right. Also, I did uh, check off screen a bit more to see if any of the Tifling kids has something to say so I can maybe finish this quest by find my belongings or like literally take my stuff from one of their crates and whatnot. And I did find there is their stash, but I think uh, they only have the amulet that the kids stole. Other than that, I have not found any other items that says your belongings or whatnot. But if I access that stash, even if I just access it, not to take anything from it, take the amulet because that's the only thing there, uh, I get like minus five reputation. Not sure if it's with the whole grove or just the tiefling kids. And there is actually that gives me a quest to return the amulet. I'll give it a thought. Maybe, maybe. There is one way if uh, I would have a potion of invisibility, which I don't think I have anymore. Okay, this was spear 07. Not sure how good uh, that one is gonna be to use. So it's just the amulet. But yeah, if I come across another potion of invisibility or if I already have, have it around here, I think I doubt it. Keep your a potion sleep. Up. Uh, fire resistance. I'm needed. Let's march. Yeah, nothing off. So that's progress. Or maybe I could buy one. Then I'll just give it to Asterion or I don't know one of my characters and just sneak my way to take the amulet. Okay, so. No, to put my hands no, no, no! Don't amulet. close. The door. Don't close the doors. Okay, so let's get out of here, and I was expecting this one to be have a bit more stuff in it, but disappointed. Okay, I could fast travel here, but the south part is completed. And we do have quite a bit more to explore up here as well. After we... Looks like... This could be something hidden. Out here. Maybe I could jump around. Could be a bit of secret in that spot. But yeah, we have where we did with the paladins or whatever those tears guys. All good. Uh, you know what, I'll pass travel to the village. Hopefully I'm not gonna go into combat. And uh Let's see with the cellar. Maybe there's something I missed around here. Should be something here. I mean, this book bookcase right here is like really crooked. Is there by any chance? No perception activation either. I mean, there's some hidden buttons or whatnot. Anything? This is the only thing that seems odd right here. This bookcase right there. Subtle steps. Let's see if I. The pride of the gate, keeping pace. 
Yeah, I don't... Nothing is getting active around here. Oh! Can't give up now. How did I miss this lever? How did I miss... I did miss it. Best be on my way. And that bookcase that was crooked is just crooked. Wonderful. That's a lot of caskets around here. Oh, hi. Okay. Hey, okay, we're gonna have a fight. And he's gonna open... Okay, weapon enchantment. What about the... You missed. Where do I go from here? Did that mount? Right. Uh... <laughs> How did you do a critical miss? My turn. Yes, your turn, Kalek. Uh, Ready for this. Do reckless attack, please don't miss. What did I say? Please don't miss. This is my freaking damn it. Um. Long rest for the hunter's mark. Fifty-fifty. Oh, that's a five. And okay, that guy is gonna fire. It is what it is. That's a six. Okay. Uh, I have advantage. Nothing is ever I easy. Need. John. Ooh, crystal heat. <laughs> Ow. This is gonna feel good. You think? Okay, 88 percent. If you miss this collect, how are you missing 88 percent? No holding back. Unfortunately, okay, he missed as well. Nice. There you go. Right, collect to. A bit of damage. I'm gonna use a potion. Might be useful. So I'm assuming we're gonna have more fights if I open Swift as my feet the rest. Okay, Ace for Azure Tunnel Gods 2. As the god of wizards, all who spend their whole lives learning. He grants the spells both big and small for Mistra or his yearning. Bane the tyrant, the black hand, makes sure I'm the strong do roll. I can't spread. Wait to sleep. His darkness through the land, raised by the harsh and cruel. Beshaba will bring forth your doom unless you chant her prayer. Split from Timora in the womb, she brings back luck to spare. That didn't exactly rhyme at the end, at least not for me. Okay, what we're gonna find in this chest game? There we go. Uh, dark vision, right? Gold. Uh, 
sure. I'll give that to Karlak and then this one to Wheel. Scroll of Enlarge, Force Life. Ah, it's unfortunate. I need to reorganize this a bit more. But, yeah. We have not uh, searched you. We searched you. Mace, Bone Chill. We give that to Asteria and I'm gonna spread a bit the uh, scrolls out here. Attention. Let's move. Okay, and let's uh, open the next casket. Oh! Another step forward. Okay, dark journal. Six night doll, night doll, 1371 DR. I pay no services to the gods, but by some blessing, this village believes me and my apprentice to be simple healers. My tattoos are hidden, my red robes oh, locked away, and my lab secured. I have not heard the word Thay since we arrived, and only my apprentice knows me as Ilin Toth. This place is not ideal for my research, but I can never return home. Not the way I escaped. I'll be put to death, with wars to follow. The work here is simple, and allows me to continue my research at night. But progress is slow. Reanimation seems easy. But restoring life? That pride eludes me. The tomb contains the magic I need, but it fights me at every step, as does my apprentice. At least my familiar has made it easy to secure bodies without raising suspicion. This will take time. Will the Zulkiers find me before I can bring her back? I cannot say. But if they do come for me, they'll have to face the guardians I've raised. Oh, that was actually... He was a necromancer. That actually updated the journal. Someone quasi it. On the lower planes. A familiar, okay. Can turn invisible and scare enemies. And then what else? Oh, scrap, really? It's a dagger. Not bad. <laughs> Hold up, can I throw the rock? Yes, I can. Kalek, you have the not buster. <laughs> buster. <laughs> uh, you can have the that one as well. Uh, Wheel, you can have that one. Shovels, friend, find really. Oh, I'm keeping this one. I'm gonna sell the other shovel. And yeah, I'm gonna sell the dagger as well. Really? Nobody else around here? Or maybe. Always room for because more. I clear those guys, they didn't get a chance to get to other sarcophagus and open them. I see, maybe it's not gonna be two combats Just at the same point. time. Mirror? Mirror on the wall? Right. Uh, I'm gonna do a warlock. Arcana. Check. Give myself some guidance. Yeah, that was actually close. The magic is old and wavering, but you recognize it. The mirror is a thinking lock. Hiding some secret. The face is crafted to be pleasing, but the personality is just a reflection of the wizard that created it. Speak your name. Memnon Thrace. Ah, uh, repeat the name from your book you read, Ilin Toth. My master was human, pure, and true. You are not Elintoth. Oh. If you are his ally, step forward and declare it. Oh, 
Do I have intimidation? I can. Should I do intimidation? Yeah, sure. Screw it. It's a 15 though. Whew. I was actually uh, getting a bit close. There is a pause as those glass eyes take you in. Then... Thank you. Asterion is inspired, apparently. Trick the magic mirror in the... Nice. A well-guarded laboratory. What were they hiding down here? A lot of things, I assume. Hopefully. Research notes. Basilic. Featherfall. Moonhaven logbook. Merchant arrives at Moonhaven. Octar raid. Night. A lot of raids. These are guys just to transmitting metals and recipes for weapons of war. Anything about the rack? No. Necromancy of stay. A train. Someone doesn't like visitors. Yeah, tell me about it. Ooh, braces of defense. Become the bulwark again. As long as you're not wearing armor or holding a shield. I mean, that should work for Kalak, right? Right? I'm assuming. Okay, let's give that to Kalak Unlucky because she's not thanks. wearing any shields. So it should be 16, right? It says as long as you're not wearing armor or holding a shield. So I'm not holding a shield. All about... Ah... Unfortunately, I yeah, I need to take out the armor as well, by the looks of it. Because if I take it off, it's gonna be fifteen. Where am I so, needed? unfortunately, what that's not helping Trust me at all. Don't be shy. But it should work. Because it's one of the other. It's not saying as long as you're not wearing armor and holding a shield. Should, I mean, shouldn't we say like, oh, okay, you don't have a shield, you have plus two. Weird. Okay, I'm, I'm, I mean, yeah, she can have it. Maybe, maybe. Actually works and uh, interesting times. doesn't exactly show. Okay. Never a dull moment. The evil eye. Hold up. No. Well met. No, I didn't even want to talk with you. While the number of trinkets and bargains hag a hag. A hag personally acquires means that her powers will be unique compared to that of her sisters. Hags, as a whole, can still be divided into three subcategories. Night hags, named as such for their ability to haunt a mortal's dream, slowly devouring vital essence until the victim's soul can be trapped into the hag's soul bag. They are known for being petty, self selfish braggarts. Sea hags, known for devouring their victims whole, sea hags can terrorize and kill with a single look. They reek of fish and are incapable of making a proper cup of tea. 
green hags. They are beautiful, they are powerful. Speak not a word against them. Never wanted the easy path. Uh, but I have the feeling that uh, I was just gonna do that. <laughs> gonna speak against them. Uh, mug ward, wooden chest. Uh, okay, French philosophy, empty potion bottle. What's uh, in this chest? A lot of scrolls. We can have the scorching ray. Charm person I'm gonna keep. Scroll of fear, we can give that to Kalak. And then the rest I'll see. It looks like this is more or less everything around. Okay, skeleton, anything there, just a candle. Research notes. Today's dead, failed. Gone too long, body decomposed. The animation, failed. Came back as a goal, had to kill again. Weak with dead, failed. Answers, unhelpful. Clone, failed. Needs living tissue. Reanimation plus clone, failed. How to kill both ghouls. Resurrection. Failed. Why? Magical curse. True resurrection. I have reached the limit of my skills and resources. The book offers help. Dare I accept. Ooh. So the book uh, kind of has a mind of its own. Is that what you're telling me? And this, okay. This doubles back here. Gotcha. Uh, rusted key. I'm gonna assume this is gonna be for this one here. Yeah. Okay. The simple toxin can have the staring can have it. So let's disarm these. Oh, even with all those bonuses. Damn, I rolled really, really low. Holy moly. No one stopped me yet. Hey. Okay. Yep. Careful. There's a trap. Then Asterian. Huh? Uh, we're gonna have to disarm this as well. But I don't like the look of those gargoyles. Are you for real? That was a one. Come on, and I do twenty-nine. And these uh. things have stayed interesting. What's oh, what about here? the cocoons? Yeah, I don't like the look of that book. Also, the gargoyles. Maybe, yeah, that will. If I didn't disarm the trap, I didn't see maybe would have had a fight here with the gargoyles. The book is locked tight with no visible keyhole, only an oval recess in the cover's mouth. So three journal entries updated you try to examine the book but the longer you stare the more those piercing amethyst eyes draw you in please don't open the creepy book <laughs> that looks terribly heavy why don't you let me carry it for you we surely shouldn't leave such a threat out where anyone could stumble across it I'm just gonna tug the book. 
because he can read. I'll, uh, I'll see what I'll do with it later on. Dark journal. I think I can safely sell that one. We'll see. Maybe even the the notes out here. Oh, some of them. Go to the graveyard and curve in. Oh, I'm encumbered, really? How heavy is this? Oh no, I'm not encumbered. Why was I moving slowly? Uh, we found a strange and powerful stone. Necromancy of Tay. What should we do with it? Must be a way to destroy it. A key gem. Some kind of stone. Huh. Is... Is the evil eye red? That's the resurrection. Seems simple enough. Light on my feet. There's nothing else here. Right? Any kind of... I don't know. Gem or anything to insert it. So I guess... I'm just gonna leave it as it is for now. Okay. We're back at the village and we still have quite a bit to explore. So I'm glad that I have an inspiration from the Beer Master for. Asterion. Okay, so that should mostly be done with that cellar. There's more I can go in the south. Shabby wooden doors. I think I already went there. I thought that was the first. That was the cellar, actually. No, I want to go inside. I don't want to go on the roof. I cliff's journal. Ah, this is the blueprints and whatnot. Uh, what in there? There are like three big guys around here? Or I did they... No, they're still here. Let's see what's with these guys. Oh. Oh. Are they eating a tiefling? Tastes like chicken. No really? chicken. <laughs> Tastes like fish. Gentlemen, contain yourselves. This quarrel sells our feast. Besides, tastes like pork. And what surprise is this? Brothers, look here. I have eyed yet another tiefling prize. Fortune favors our bellies. Stranger, be you friend or food. The mark is her measure. Show us the brand of the absolute. So are you eating a uh, tiefling? She scampered in from the east, calling for you, a pet, no doubt. The green earth bless us. She bore no mark, those horns. Such cartilaginous crunch. Let's see the mark, lest I give in to my cravings. What mark? Ooh. 
Oh, I can do a deception. Uh, I have uh, from charisma though. Right. Uh, I'll try it. I'll do you one better. I'm one of the absolutes chosen disciples. It's a 10. And I I put uh, friends and 21. Indeed. How regrettable that your meat must go unsavored. I'm sorry, what? Food? No. Food. Not food. Friend. I mean, I notice you don't bear a brand of your own. I've no use for the absolute or any god. I follow two masters only. Gluttony and greed. <laughs> the goblins understand my appetites. They sate my hunger for gold. And the rest sate my hunger for meat. Boss goblin give gold. We check brand. Good deal. No talk. Bonk. <laughs> Ah, I mean, forget the goblins. You should be fighting for me. I am, by all accounts, a student of higher commerce and extortion. Sure you are, buddy. Make me an offer. Tempt me. Ooh. Five hundred gold. It's a lot of gold. Then 1,000 after you fight for me. In the flesh of the fallen. You'll have your fill. Uh, not sure uh, how... My... My party members will take this. Uh, I'm not giving 500 gold or 1000. Mm, so it's either the second and or third. You know what? I'll risk uh, deception. I'll give you 1000 gold. After you fight for me. Add... Okay. Is that natural 20? I twice played serenade to my ears, my tasty kibble. We have a bargain. Take my bone horn. One blow and the ground will quake with my family name. Kalak approves, apparently. Use it when the need arises. And never a moment before. Ogre kill everyone around, then Ogre eats them! Well spoken, indeed. Ogre kill everyone around. And gotta say, you're quite the articulate Ogre. Am I not astonishing? A robust diet makes for a shrewd mind, you see. I... I'm a gourmand, <laughs> and you, a delicacy. Were I so lucky? And yeah, seen a few og other ogres in these parts. We follow the sense of blood and gold to all lands fertile, friend. And this land proves particularly fruitful. Hey, that's pretty much it. We cannot talk. We will keep close. When you are ready, sound the horn. Okay, they just disappear. Uh, that tiefling. That might be worth a look. Right, so why would I do that? Also, 
can't just lock it. Rope, sickle, these tools. Yes, yes, I'm encumbered. Uh, we can have that. I'm not no longer encumbered. Cool. Oh, this is just a clip. Can I not read it? Old school book. Someone's diary. Might explain what happened here. Okay, that's folly in the fall. Who's diary? School attendants feel like. The... Note in the margin states that somebody has to investigate what's become of the missing children and their families. I'm assuming that one. Weren't there four books? I got here. Lyra, Lady of Deception, the goddess who wears many masks. Invoke her name, avoid perception. She hides your lies and secret tasks. For joy to Lyra, you must call and worship her through soulful dance. So find her presence in feast halls. Do not give illness a chance. Leviathan's pleasure is your pain. Your scars, an offering, scourge, or candle whip, or cane, can your devotion bring. Uh, right, Asterian, you're gonna be the person you're gonna carry some stuff. Which diary uh, was it? Sicko, get this. That was weird that I couldn't give the sequel to Asterion. I'm sure you can have the locket. I guess the leather gloves. And you can have that one as well. Right, what's with... I'm gonna uh, actually you know what everybody come here I'll lack don't burn yourself I'll On try not to uh, I'm not sure if this is gonna bring everything on top of me wait call you cannot see it really I have a lot on my mind is it because I'm I was the only one that I saw it, it? Saw it. Should mind my step. Okay, boulder. Oh, I could go up. for a good meal. Nah, just to watch your back. The pride of the gate. Best foot forward. You let me attack once, and that was it. What? Can't I attack it more? What's up here that you let me attack? Let's see. Okay, I cannot uh, jump there. Yeah, but okay, why did you? Is that why he stopped attacking because I didn't want to bring this on everybody. And he had a, some life on it. Okay, I guess. Whatever. Let's see if we can uh, 
Yeah, we can get up here. I s game. Have wished to live in more interesting times. Come on. What's this? Can I not walk? Yeah, I can walk here. Okay, I'll catch a break. Okay, why can't I? There we go. Let's have a look. Um, what do you mean can get here? Sure, whatever. I'll jump. Is this? Huh. Did they actually destroy the path? But I'm not seeing it visually. Okay, and, and written. What's on your mind? There's some stuff around here. Charles drawing. And written note. Dear Flora, happy birthday. I know, I finally finished the painting. And not just any painting. Does it look familiar? I'll give you a hint. It involved me getting down on one knee, and you're making me the happiest woman alive. I'd best go. I hear a silence in the classroom next door. That's never a good sign. Happy birthday, my love. Amanda. Okay. One. I think that's uh, what ha what happened out here. This is actually destroyed, but it doesn't show visually. Right, there's just a warning poster that I want to see really quick. Missing children: Maggie Terrence, Marcus Terrence, Mathen Deach, Rochelle Kirk. One into the Sword Coast. Uh, Apart from an overgrowth of moss, the well looks unremarkable. Uh, although, I think I saw we had the caves underneath. And I think this is just underneath the cave. Or just above the cave, where and at the bottom there's a corpse. So let's go into the well. Any bonus? Sure, I'll have some kind of guidance. 13. Dry stones line the wall. At the bottom, something gleams in the dappled light. Uh, sure. If I can climb back up. <laughs> that is. Ruby ring, short sword. Right, so we're uh, up here, down here actually. Okay, uh, I'm gonna leave it here then for this episode. I'll probably just go back. I'll have to go back actually to clear some of the stuff out here. Definitely need to clear. Can I examine and see? Right. But yeah, I'll clear some of this inventory. I'll. I think I can sell the portrait with no issues, hopefully, and then uh, we'll continue next time. But for now, hopefully you enjoyed this episode, guys. And as always, don't forget to take care.